Babylon 5 is seceding from the Earth Alliance. UK entry for world's biggest tarts is the name of the video. A compilation video of people here in the UK who are basically claiming that uh, they can confront and, I don't know, shout down the Illuminati. They can claim to have some kind of extra authority. Uh, hey, Illuminati, don't give me COVID, uh, don't activate 5G, and yeah, basically go back to Mars. My name is Princess Lyra Grace, Starseed Avalon Helen of the Blue Light Collective and the Pink Quartz Affinitive. I'm the Doctor. I'm a Time Lord. I'm from the planet Gallifrey in the constellation of Casterberus. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is one hell of an introduction from a conspiracy nut. But uh, where does it lead? Well, let's see. And this is my declaration of sovereignty. But uh, how far does that go? Directed at the Cabal, the Illuminati, the Dark Lords, the Deep State, the global elitists. What's she talking about? The demons inside your head, pretty much. <laughs> you know, oh yeah, uh, Illuminati, because that's a real thing. Oh uh, yeah, the secret, the secret Cabal that runs the government. Why don't you just throw in there the reptilian aliens while you're at it? I, Helen, am a sovereign human being. Freedom is my divine right. Divine right. Freedom is your divine right. Freedom is a, well, a right within societies that recognise freedom. And to varying degrees. But a divine right? And, you know, considering your title, are you saying you're that divine force? Because these people seem to give themselves titles and make it their part of this higher power, this higher force. And you're going to tell the evil ne'er-do-wells who apparently run the world in your little head they seem to be so real you're going to tell them they can't do what they want to do <laughs> i suppose if you're in a desperate situation fantasy is very often what people fall back on too and i do not consent to your corrupt and malevolent plans for world domination human beings were born free and i do not consent to your plans to run a a slave workforce in humanity. We will remain an independent state until President Trump is removed from office. Supposedly we're run by an Illuminati elite that wants to rule over the world, call it what you will, and it wants to enslave humanity, and you don't consent, and they would listen to you because you call yourself a stupid name. My name is Princess Lyra Grace, Starseed Avalon Helen of the Blue Light Collective and the Pink Quartz Affinitive. I mean, when you come down to it, the whole idea isn't very convincing. I do not consent to your plans to control and depopulate Mother Earth. I withdraw all permissions for you to roll out 5G across the globe. Hey, Super Ascended Princess. Princess Lyra Grace, Starseed Avalon Helen of the Blue Light Collective and the Pink Quartz Affinitive. Uh, let me ask you, if you're withdrawing consent, right now that means consent must have been given in the past so are you saying you gave permission to the illuminati to depopulate the world <laughs> doesn't that make you the enemy oh you're withdrawing it now oh that's okay or perhaps it was a poor choice of phrase well if it's a poor choice of phrase you don't come across as very enlightened or as a higher being when you can't even express basic intellectual concepts used commonly in the english language I do not permit you to secure mandatory vaccination for the fake pandemic that is COVID-19. Ah! Madam, I have not disappeared. I am very tiny. I am a germ, a rare disease. And you caught me, Mim! What?! Remember, if you disagree with this mother goddess princess doodah from outer space or wherever, that means you must be part of the conspiracy and you're trying to promote the idea of a global cull. Because that's the way things work. Hmm. <laughs> oh, right. Like it's my fault. You are no longer permitted to control the governments of Earth as I assert my sovereignty and declare your time is over. Oh great, I guess COVID's over then. I guess it's all gone and all the bad people are gone and they all fly off in their UFOs or alien craft or whatever. They fly off to the Orion Belt, don't they? And uh, I don't know, they go and 
do whatever they do when they're not ruling over human civilization. Except um, if nothing changes and COVID doesn't go away and the people you call Illuminati don't go away, doesn't that kind of disprove your ability, your power as some kind of ascended being, some kind of alien goddess? Doesn't it? Princess Lyra Grace, Starseed Avalon Helen of the Blue Light Collective and the Pink Quartz Affinitive. I do not consent to your abuse and ritualized slaughter and torture of innocent children worldwide. Your underground hostage and rape tunnels are being emptied. Yet, has anyone actually been able to find a single fucking tunnel? <laughs> You've got secret tunnels, secret bases. Hey, you might even have secret cities underground, right? So, um, apparently this is where all the, uh, you know, kind of Bill Cosby, Michael Jackson, Jimmy Savile kind of shit goes on, but with people like George W. Bush, right? Okay, let's just say that's true. Um, where the fuck are the tunnels? They're being emptied. Okay, where are the tunnels? If they're empty, then we can go and investigate, can't we? A bit of urban exploration? No, I guess not. Um, how do we know they're being emptied unless you prove they're being emptied, unless you're simply being... A delusional fantasist, basically. I do not permit you to cruelly murder young, innocent babies so that you may create adrenochrome for your Hollywood puppets. Prove it. And she makes many other proclamations from her ivory tower, her imaginary ivory tower. She's no one important. She's a rambling cartoon on the internet, as there are so many. I should have left you on that street corner where you were standing. My name is Katie Davies, and this is my declaration of sovereignty directed at cabal, illuminati, global elites, dark lords of the deep state. Freedom is my divine right, and I do not consent to your corrupt and male male malevolent plans. My name is Hugo Santiago, and this is my declaration of sovereignty directed at the cabal, the Illuminati, the global elitists, dark lords. I, Elizabeth Sardbog, formally put the de facto UK state government and crown on notice. Um, I am Rebecca. I'm a sovereign human being. Freedom is my divine right. I don't, I don't understand the question. Yes, it's basically the sovereign human being argument. No, I, I'm not a citizen. I'm a member of humanity and uh, nations are merely held together by a social contract. And therefore I choose to dissolve it, even though 99.9% .9 of the population have not chosen to do the same as this person. But in any case, they're all basically making a claim that would not stand up in a court of law, has no validity, has no special privilege does not debunk or refute anything. And it's based on remarkable and irrational claims. At least it was based on something real. You could say, okay, you might have a point and you might end up with a large following, at least relatively large compared to what you've got now. As it is, you just simply seem to be a bunch of cartoons. And of course, they're, they're claiming that they're protected. I'm protected now because I've made my declaration of sovereignty. Your government is on notice. But there's no value, I repeat, there is no value to these things unless you happen to have the dramatic following of millions of people. And I think a lot of these people will probably regret making these very public, irrational announcements on social media online in years to come. Oh, right. Like it's my fault. 